is your opinion on financial buying financial assets, stocks? Buying financial assets or stocks, we say if they include riba, if they include unknown dealings, great amount of risks, if they include products and services which are clearly haram and against the deen, then we say stay far away from them. As for if they don't, then that's a different story. What they consider unto law. We know what most of these things entail in the current day, unfortunately, but that doesn't mean that all of them do. That's my opinion on that. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala surely knows best. Once you get caught up in the web of riba, and that's just not only problem, that's not the only problem. As many people think, unfortunately, it's much more than just riba. Riba is bad. It's one of the seven destructive sins. As the Prophet told us in the authentic hadith. However, there are other problems. Someone selling something that they do not own. Two contracts in one. Risk. Gambling. Haram products. Haram services. Khamar. Khinzir. Idols. All types of instruments and things that are against Allah and His Rasul. It's all prohibited. And it's not just riba. Not scorning riba, not disdaining riba, saying that it's a small thing. No, it's a major sin. And Allah has warned us severely against it. We're not saying that riba is a small, tiny thing. But we're trying to get you to broaden your scope because many Muslims, they try hard when it comes to riba. Alhamdulillah. But they don't realize that they fall into other problems as well that are prohibited. That are what? That are prohibited. Wallahu ta'ala alam.